Okay, a couple more sound bites here, and we'll get to your phone calls. This is uh, Fox News Channel Friday night. Special report, Brett Baer. He is uh, in the roundtable here, and here's how he opens one of the topics on the roundtable discussion. Today, Rush Limbaugh was talking about this battle between one and two, Donald Trump and Ted Cruz, and here's what he had to say. Look, folks, you and I know the Republican establishment no more wants Donald Trump than they want Cruz. They don't want either of them. But they hate Cruz. They despise Cruz because they're afraid of Ted Cruz. Trump, on the other hand, they don't even think is a Republican. When you get right down to brass tacks of people inside the Republican Party, don't even think he's a Republican. So they move on next to Dr. Krauthammer. Ted Cruz, after playing the clip, or Bayer, after after playing the clip, says... Uh, Okay, Charles, uh, what say you? There's a reason why this is now coming out, National Review, pushing back. I think they have a sense that we may be approaching a moment, an inflection point, where essentially the so-called establishment, I hate the term, the mainstream Republicans, decide to throw in the towel on the Trump candidacy, have a sense that he's inevitable. Some of them, because they really can't stand a cruise, and that you may get the beginning of establishment mainstream governors or senators. You get one or two start to endorse Trump essentially as a signal that it's okay. He's become normalized. So there's a a bit of agreement, uh, Dr. Krauthammer, with me and the Republican establishment's enmity for Ted Cruz. And his point of a national review is that they are worried that uh, Trump is about to become normalized and they're throwing in a towel. Don't want to throw in the towel on it. Assume he's going to be the nominee. They want to you know, plant the flag for, for conservatism here. Um, the, the, it's, it's a, I don't think this stuff is really hard to understand. People overanalyze this, overestimate a lot of this. Uh, and sometimes the simplest explanation for things happens to be what's right.